हेलो एवरी वन आई एम काजल सैनी योर इंग्लिश टीचर एंड वेलकम इन माई क्लास टूडे सो इन टूडेज क्लास यू आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट होमोफोन्स ओके सो वट इज होमोफोन्स सो लेट्स हैव डेफिनेशन ऑफ इट सो वर्ड्स विच साउंड द सेम बट हैव डिफरेंट मीनिंग एंड स्पेलिंग्स आर कोल्ड होमोफोन्स ओके सो इन सिंपल लैंग्वेज आई एम जस्ट टेलिंग यू मीन्स दोज वर्ड्स विच आर हैविंग the same sound and same pronunciation okay but spelling and your meaning would be different that is called your homophones is it clear means whenever you will speak any word that it would be your uh, same but meaning and spelling would be a different that is called your homophones i think it would be a clear so let's let's have some example of it like one one okay as you can see some examples are written here our our spellings you can see spellings are different sounds is same our our pail still mail okay so now how can you recognize it which one we have to use where so it depends on your sentences okay so let's have some sentence so number 1 is the boys in our yeah, our class are very mischievous means you have to use here correct homophones the boys in blank dash class are very mischievous so which word would you like to use here so our yeah our both sounds are same but this depends this tells about your time and this this tells about means apna like that so the boys in आव आवर क्लास आर वेरी मिशीवियर हमारी क्लास में जो बॉयज है बड़े शरारती है इज इट क्लियर नेक्स्ट लुक आई ब्लैंक दैट बुक एंड आई लव इट ओके आई ब्लैंक दैट बुक सो विच वन रेड यू विल यूज सो दिस इज द सेकेंड फॉर्म ऑल रेड सो आई रेड दैट बुक एंड आई लव इट सो आर ई ए डी यू विल यूज हेयर इज इट क्लियर मीन्स पढ़ी नेक्स्ट वन I will now write and write. Okay, both rights are means write on their place. But which one you would like to choose here? So the story of the ant and the grasshopper. I will now write. Okay, I will now write. लिखने वाला write you will use here. So some more example. Okay, some more examples are here like I am looking. for a beautiful doll yeah for a beautiful doll you can understand easily here that which one you have to choose okay so next example it will be wonderful yeah be wonderful both be meanings are different but sound is same so now you have to choose that which one is a correct so be e okay be e it will be wonderful if grandmother could come and stay with us okay dear students so next is also i will wait to receive the award ya yeah, wait to receive award means both wait sound is same but one wait is saying about you for stopping for intezar and second wait is saying about for a uh, virgin okay for happiness so next one next book exercise let's see book exercise part b fill in the blanks with suitable homophones from the brackets again this uh, thing is saying to you that you have to choose the suitable homophones okay so this car is made in india so which one made you would have to choose so m a d e made okay both sound is same but meaning one made is saying about the servant female okay in the female sense and second one is banana so uh, this car is made in india clear next one is father painted the fans in pale green color means both pale meaning you should you should know so one pale means like dull color means like little bit uh, dull okay like fika color which we say light color okay not dull light color you can say and second pale is about a bucket clear next example i don't want my teacher to write a note in my notebook and write a note in my notebook okay means write a note so likhne wala note 
so right will come here okay so next one their house is the one behind those trees yeah there so again the sound will, will be the same but you have to choose that which one will come so their house is it clear my lovely students so next example the ship will get sail tomorrow morning so both sail meaning you should know about that one sail is about uh, selling purchasing like na selling and purchasing like okay bechna and second sail is about your means a uh, uh, samundri yatra which you say jo bolte ho na samundri yatra so sail is that one so the ship will get sail tomorrow morning okay i hope that this lesson will help you about that understanding some homophones that which part which word you have to use here okay so next also part c so in this also you have to choose the correct homophones you have to write here correct homophones and you have to choose the incorrect one okay so now let's have i slept late late last night so this night is wrong here what is the meaning of this night is means surveer yodha fighter okay so as i was reading a novel so which night will come night n i g s t is it clear so next one is only two people were there before us in a queue so which two you will use t w o two people not two people okay so my lovely students uh this was your lesson about homophones i hope it will help you a lot and bye everyone have a great day